Good morning and welcome my friends to another Sui Shares video with me on a beautiful day. Hashtag Team All Blade and hashtag No Blade Left Behind. I gotta say right now, Subi smiles to all of you and squad goals. Thank you so much for clicking in today's shape video and for joining me for today's review. I'm absolutely thrilled whether you're a brand new user or a person that's just, you know, coming back for more. I just want to express my gratitude and really say thank you so much for paying tribute to the channel by being here, for commenting, for throwing the likes down below and for making it fun. Thank you so much for making this channel possible because without you, being here watching the content they're just videos i really do appreciate you making the content special today speaking of special i'm absolutely over the moon i'm super excited Pablo Raban by Phoenix Artisan Shaving, right? They're doing a tribute to the Pablo Raban uh, Pour Home scent with Doppelganger Green. This will be uh, releasing here shortly on their webpage. I highly, highly recommend this. If you're a person that really enjoys Foucher scents, this right here is like a barbershop Foucher. It's a really beautiful scent. I am actually not a person that has smelled the original, so I didn't really know what to expect. But off the tub, right, I had my wife smell, I smelled it, she goes, it's similar to Skin Bracer for me. I kind of agree, similar to Skin Bracer, but in my opinion, I think this is a little bit more designer. It feels a little bit more like something in a more expensive tier. I like this. I think it's very nice. It does smell fresh. I get like a, a sage and something like a rosemary. The top, the, the top and the middle notes really interact well with the bottom notes where I get like this musk and a really nice amber. There's honey to the scent. But for me, the moss is what is really coming out at the bottom. I have the moss mostly with the musk and amber kind of playing with the honey. It's a really beautiful scent. Again, Pablo Raban Pour Home. I have not actually, actually experienced the original. I'm, I would love to. <laughs> There's only so much money in the world. But I love that Doug makes that a possible scent to experience and enjoy with beautiful shades. So again, I, I'm really excited about this. The color of the fluid is like a lighter green. It's a really interesting, I think it looks very nice. And I had a ton of fun filming for it, right? For shooting some um, photography for the scent. I like it's such a plain label. And it was really fun to kind of doctor up and play with. I enjoyed light painting using their logo. I, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed like the posts, uh, the, some of the other non-video type uh, uh, posts. I, I've really enjoyed doing them. Today, we've got it already whipped up in the Moonscape, Dreamscape, Goodscape Scuttle here. I love this thing. It's one of my faves. You know I can't live without the Dreamscape Scuttle in my my life. The lather today it is so nice. It is so hydrated and it is absolutely ready for a shave. I already did the face and I did the neck with you. Um, I'll be doing those in the shave cams and putting them kind of in line as I talk. I really, really enjoyed the scent on this. The projection's great. I love how it comes across as balanced green, fresh. It's like the perfect time of year for this scent, right? Where you want to just enjoy, you know, being outside. It does have an aromatic, like an aroma, um, aromatic, like kind of floral scent to it that kind of plays well with the musk, in my opinion. I really like this. It smells masculine, yet definitely like you're outside. I really like it. It's just like this is a nice Fouchier scent. Barbershop Fouchier. Really good stuff. Okay, we're gonna be shaving today with the Phoenix Eclipse Razor with the Alpha Plate. Love this razor, we're using it again. I really wanted to do it like a Phoenix Artisan Tribute Shave because they sent the scent totally on them for review. And I just wanna say thank you again to Doug, Fran, and Hux for including our channel in their drops and remembering us and letting us do reviews for them. I am absolutely in love with their products. Again, we are uh, an affiliate of their brand. If you go below in the comments and you use our link, it does help support the channel. And it also shows me that you really are like enjoying the content. So anybody doing that, thank you so much. I know I've had a couple of notifications that it was used and I just wanted to get, take a moment and say thank you so much for doing that and for honestly for making the channel work because without those links, Links, it would be a much slower content uh, developing process. And again, huge shout out to Doug, Fran, and Hawks. I absolutely love the scent. I think it's a killer scent. I think it's the right time of year for the scent. On top of that, we're rocking out with my favorite razor personally from them right now. I just love this. It's based on the Red Ring Eclipse razor of old, right? And Red Ring Eclipse razor is very expensive, very hard to get, and they remade it. And I honestly, I, I, I may like this one a little bit better just because I can switch the handle out where the Red Ring Eclipse you couldn't, right? It's an all assembled, all together, one piece kind of razor with the bottom really being connected. It's it's 
not going to come apart. So I like this. I like this variation. I think it also makes it available to the modern shaver that doesn't want to chase one of those red ring eclipses down. Really awesome. Let me show you why. We got Persona Lab Blues with 48 hours ready to shave off, and I'm ready to shave it off for sure. I hope wherever you're tuning in from in the world today, your day is phenomenal, that it's sunny. Or if you don't want the sun, then it's nice and gray for you. I, For me, I am a person right now that's just wanting to be outside. I am dying to see the sunlight, right? I just cannot wait to be outside gardening. I don't know about everybody else, but I really am ready to be out just enjoying the, the spring weather. And it's not quite there where we live. But it wants to be, you can feel it kind of almost warming up. And I think these kind of scents, these Foucher barbershop kind of forward, just beautiful light, very, um, very dynamic scents uh, work perfectly for this time of year. Man, I needed to shave so badly. With this razor, what I do is I load it up and then I unscrew the handle just a titch, about a quarter of a turn using their spacers. And for me, that really, take a look. It really amps it up. It just gives it that little bit more punch that I wanted from the razor originally. I absolutely love this thing. Absolutely, I just love it. Man, this is great shave. What a shave, and thank you again for joining me for it. I hope you found the review exceptionally helpful, and if not, at least entertaining. I enjoy doing the reviews for these. I'm not a scent expert, but I still enjoy just getting together and enjoying the shave. I hope, again, that you understand and fully appreciate that I really do appreciate you. I really do, the viewer, the person that's coming in to share the shave. Man, what a shave this is, too. If, to, if this is the first time you've seen this razor, which it may be, right? I know that this, after it sold out, you don't, I haven't seen a lot of them, actually. I really, really like this razor. You should definitely go over and um, put in for our notifications for when it comes back because it's an awesome, awesome shaver. Really nice. I love the brass and stainless steel combo. I think the brass makes gives it like this really vintage, fun kind of, you know, timely look and timey look to it. I don't know. I like it. And then the stainless kind of modernizes it. It's cool. It's a very, it's not a super cheap razor, but I think it is a very, um, uh, they, uh, under like uh, understandably good priced razor in my opinion i think if i remember right i paid 80 dollars, and for 80 dollars, this is a beautiful piece of um shavery and just my opinion here i love how that shaves against the grain super smooth really easy angle for me i like it probably just slightly more than their dock series even and that's saying something because i really enjoy their dock series this for me I, is just very smooth very efficient while still being, you know, comfortable. You can rock it on a 24 hour amount of growth without any issues, but you can go 72 hours, get a good shave. Oh, what a good one that was too. Woo! So stinking, really close. Very, very comfortable, very fun. I really enjoy these scents that just give you that like sense of you just got out of the shower, right? That's kind of what this feels like. Kind of feels like I just climbed out of the shower Right, I'm ready for the day. Oh man, this is gonna be a good one, I can tell you that. This is gonna be an awesome scent for this time of year. Great, really enjoyed this. Thoroughly, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed knocking that off and getting BBS with you today. It was fantastic, it was close, and it was a fast, efficient shave, right? We did that whole entire thing in like, I don't know, five seconds. It flew by. It is, for me, it's a marshmallows only kind of razor from Phoenix. I really like it. The, the razor itself, well built, good tolerances. You can see the machine marks from the factory, but other than that, I really enjoy the way it, uh, it polished up. I did polish mine up and I just love the way it turned out. I think it's awesome. I think it makes it look very unique. I know not everybody's a fan, but I like it. I like it a lot. I really think that is a nifty, nifty piece. Really cool and again, available over at Phoenix Shaving. I just think this is awesome. Doesn't get enough play right now because Honestly, they're all sold out. They've been sold out forever. I've been watching and kind of hoping it would come back because I really do like talking about it and I like recommending it to people that are into the vintage razors and looking for one in a modern era or one that feels like one in a modern era. Having a little bit of the splash. Wow. Just right off the bottle, right off the bottle here. It smells fantastic. 
it's like very, very forward on the Fouchere, like, you know, ambiance. It just feels, smells exactly like you would expect from like a barbershop Fouchere. Really cool. It's nice. It's in, it's a very inviting scent. I don't find that this is a scent that would, you know, deter people. I, I really think you could be sitting on a bus and most people would like this. I think it's nice. It's masculine without being too, uh, you know, forwardly masculine, if that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense. I really like this one from Phoenix Shaving. Really beautiful. I'm going to go with a second splash here today. We're going with a second splash. Why? Because we're going to do it. We want to. We it, it, Oh, man, that's good. I like that a lot. Not a ton of burn at all on the neck. Face, cheeks, you can see here. It was a sweet shave. It was a nice, smooth. That'll last for 15 hours. And I enjoyed having you here for it. Thank you again for making the channel a part of your day. Wherever you are tuning in from, I really did appreciate sharing my day with you. I think this is really cool. I love getting to share the hobby. And again, if you haven't, go over there, check out Phoenix Shaving and do it through our link, darn it. Yeah, it's an awesome, awesome brand that really does produce some of my favorite scents right now on the market. This one included. This is fantastic. I like all the Doppelganger series. Honestly, there's not been a Doppelganger I didn't like, and this goes right in the pile. Thank you again for joining me for the beautifully close laser level shape. I'll catch you guys in the next Subi Shape video. And until then, Subs out. <laughs>